dollars. Huh. Yours truly. Yo, Street Daddy Dollars. No saying represent Trail 5, MIA, and definitely all the thugs. I'm what you call a nigga. I call myself nigga robbing. Because I'm with what the niggas that used to be robbing. Niggas used to be out there getting it. So, nigga robbing. And not nigga robbing. No, nothing. I ain't slandering nobody. Uh, religion, background, or culture, or nothing. Other race. I'm a nigga robbing. My first record was like nine years ago with Luke. And my first album came out, I think, um, 96 or 97, based on the true story. Luke put Miami on the map all in one in a whole because, you know what I'm saying? He was the first one to get the girls on the G-string. He the first one to get the girl on girl thing going. He the first one was talking about getting his dick sucked on the record. And and people, you know what I'm saying, accepted that. Because that was going on. You know, people get their dick sucked. People suck dick. They don't know about we got weed hoes. They don't know about we got struggles. They don't know about niggas laying in the street. They don't know we got different police departments and station. They don't know it's 15 to 20 different script clubs within a two-mile radius. You know, they don't know about AK-47s, they don't know about uh, AR-15s, Mini-14, SKs, they don't know nothing about shit like that, you know what I'm saying? South Beach just know about Wet Willies and Fat Tuesdays and Opium, Gardens, you know, Miami's bigger than that, Miami deeper than Nino Brown. As far as me keeping it real, that's what I do, so it's gonna have haters some type of way or another, so it's gonna be a nigga here and there trying to scrape me across me, and I'm gonna handle that. All of it to some same shit. All of it to some same shit like that punt, nigga. Punt. Respect my gangster. But as far as being in New York, I ain't really never did nothing. No. I want to hang with the real niggas. I want to hang with Ja Rule. I want to be hang with DMX. And I like, you know what I'm saying? I like Method Man. The red man from from Jersey. You know what I'm saying? I, that's I, I'm the kind of niggas I fuck with. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really into no... no Fake niggas, I like Jim Jones and I like Cameron, real street niggas, you know what I'm saying? I like Fat Joe, man. You know, I need to hang with gutter ass niggas, not, not red copper ass niggas and forget where you from and marry the white girl ass niggas. Well, Atlantic, you know, Touche came and Ted came and got the deal through Atlantic and everything, you know what I'm saying? Everything was working fine, but now they got new head niggas over here, and the head nigga ain't with it, and he ready to get busy, and I'm ready to get bigger, so busy, so we're gonna do better, bigger things, and you know, I'm already getting exposure and record play in places I never got it. I'm already doing interviews with y'all, some motherfucking shit I ain't never did, so it's all good, so it's, it's all for the better, you know? The new single is like featuring me, Lil John, and Twister, something different, man, and we put it down, it's called Let's Go. It's basically where I'm letting people know I ain't no rapper, I ain't no actor. It's like, I ain't, I ain't no fake type dude. Like, if I don't like you, I don't talk to you. It's just, it's straight, it's street, but with a little rock to it. You know what I'm saying? I need the bass, I need the snares, I need the hi-hats. They can come slow or fast, but I need them to feel it. I need to be clear. I need when the bass hit, I want the bass to hit all, and I want my voice to be strong when it's mixed in, because that's how I'm giving it to you. You know what I'm saying? I need, I need, originality. I need something that when I hear it, I already can think of a hook to it. And if it's going to be a sample, I need a damn good sample. You know what I'm saying? As far as music, I'm, I'm going to keep going with the music. I mean, I'm here forever with the music. If not me, somebody else will come along. Maybe I'll, I'll start getting my son into it. But he ain't going to be no, he ain't coming out weak. He ain't coming out soft. I don't care if the girls don't like him. He going to give it to him. When he old enough to curse, I'm going to let him curse if he had to. Being that we got all the churn out the way, let's eat some pussy without cussing. The next song called Shook On My Tongue, all right? Featured me and Ludacris. Let's do this shit. A thug to me, somebody that got damn good sense. Somebody got their own mind, their own heart. A thug is somebody like Scarface, you know what I'm saying? He, all he have is his balls. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people let their they, they, they head overload their ass, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of people want to wear size nine and a half, no really wear elevens. You know what I'm saying? Just keep it real, you know what I'm saying? A thug is a nigga to me that respect other niggas and know that if you're a real nigga, that means I'm a real nigga. And cause I'm a real nigga don't mean you're a fuck nigga. It mean less to say some of us better than most of us, ain't none of us better than all of us. But don't fuck around and fuck around and get stuck in the ground, you know? Yo, it's your boy Trick Daddy Dollars representing the Trail 5. Shouts out to Blow Magazine. The DVD, all that shit, represent, you know what I'm saying? Compliments to Slip and Slide Records, Atlanta Records, my own label, Don't Ride Entertainment. The rest of you don't like it, fuck you.